Ciao friends, welcome to our Van Life Italy vlog in Abruzzo, where adventure meets culture and every corner hides a hidden gem. Join us as we dive into local traditions, taste delicious Italian cuisine and soak up breathtaking views. Are you ready? Let's hit the road. Got ourselves another area di sosta, free campsite for tonight, at camper van park. Oh, you're talking to me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes, you. I thought you were going to go for it. <laughs> yes, we have a uh, free camp. Again. Again in uh, Pastiria. Pastitru? Pastitrama. Now oh, you made that up, I don't know. <laughs> the uh, name of the bottle. <laughs> we're just walking to town now. 600 meters. We can't read the sign. But it says bears. Yeah, stop for bears. I've not decided a bit. This is the name of the town, Pacentro. This castle dates back to 951. It's the oldest castle in the region. It's a very, very old castle. Castle. <laughs> Ciao. Ciao. One up. <laughs> Driving, we had to change the fuel filter for a simple time on the dashboard, so we thought, oh, we'll just buy one and we'll change it. Like he said, no problem. So we found one this morning, but you can't get it detached without like a filter remover. So we've just driven to a mechanic on a Saturday afternoon just before they close and they're letting us borrow the tool. So we're just doing it in front of their garage. Straight out the fuel. Lock in, all fixed? Yeah. All fixed. And the nice guys it. here let us borrow the part and they wouldn't take any money for letting, uh, not the part, the tool to remove it and they wouldn't take any yeah. money. They were lovely. Nice guys. Yeah, very lucky. So, on the road again. Let's go. We are in the Miguela So what are we up to this afternoon? Weather has cleared. Yeah, so we're going to this place, but I don't think this is the correct Yeah, <laughs> it is. What you took a photo of is called Ermo di Santo Spiritu a Miella. Yeah. 
But I don't think that's right. Oh, well, it's the other one was Hermitage of San Giovanni Church or something. Whatever it is, I'll, we'll leave a title below. I don't think what we said is right. So we parked Tommy up there in some parking. There were some other cars parked because there's some rock climbers down here and we just weren't sure of the car park. So we're going to walk three and a half kilometers to get there instead. Aren't we? Sure. Ermo di Santo Spiritual A Magella. So we are walking inside the church cave wall, which is actually the side of the rock wall. Going in. Ciao. We are, going we are going to go di San Martino. Gorges di San Martino. It's called Gorge, if you translate it, it's like Gorges of San Martino. Which is up to the And apparently some remains as well. That's about an hour. And my Ashley standards, I should be thinking she can do that in 20 minutes. Yep. Challenge accepted. Because everything is a competition. Yep, it is. And we must win. Vino, and this is another sulfur natural hot springs. This one does have a bit of a stench to it, more than the Sacrino one that we were at a couple of weeks ago. So these hot springs are actually not allowed to swim in, so just beautiful to look at. Did you touch it? It's freezing cold! So it is not hot springs, it is freezing cold. So I'm not sure. Look, Lynn. <laughs> Tell me it was hot springs, but it must just be sulfur in the water. So we've just looked it up and it says that it's natural sulfuric springs. Sulfurous springs. So I don't know, maybe we got confused. I didn't really look into it too much so still very beautiful but not hot springs natural springs today we have to go to Palazzo you say and we are going up to Castello di Rocco, like a castle up on the top of the hill.
afternoon we have driven to El Aquila. Aquilia. Today is a public holiday as well, so I don't know if things will be quieter or busier. Depends what's open, I guess. A lot of these really old Italian cities are actually under like construction scaffold buildings that are so old they're just falling apart. Sometimes you get here and you're expecting to see all these beautiful old buildings and then they're just covered in scaffold but I guess that's all part of it when they're so old that they fall apart and crumble. Found a nice free camp by a lake. Yes, finally. Before we head back into big city Rome tomorrow. Back into chaos. <laughs>